Hello everyone. So today I will show you how to draw and paint a ballet dancer step by step in this watercolor tutorial. So we need these materials for our watercolor painting. A handmade paper must be required or you can use any paper that gives texture. So first we spread our water in this handmade paper. I am using a flat brush. You can use your round brush easily. After spreading water, then we use called blue. First we mix it and then we spread in this water that we have already put in this paper. Then we take a little bit of Persian blue and mix with cob blue and then we also spread in this paper like this. Then we take a little bit of water and mix this color and blend it. I am using a hair dryer for dry this paper. Then we use our Persian blue and a little bit of black to make this Persian blue extra dark even it is dark but not so dark. That's why I am using a little bit black and spread it in this paper like this. After spreading, then I use a little bit of water and I make it blend this color and mix this color with this paper. I also done with both sides. If you guys already have subscribed to our youtube channel then thanks a lot for supporting us and support us to achieve our goal of 10,000 subscribers in this month and if you have not subscribed to our youtube channel yet then please get subscribed now click the red button and support us to achieve our goal of 10,000 subscribers and join to our learn fine art. Then I spread a little bit water and I am using a little bit yellow for a light and bright for our subject giving a light because I am using here a 
yellow and some violet color after using this yellow color then we blend it with water then I use a little bit once again black and some Persian blue to make this painting more dark this side because the light coming from here so we have to make this side more dark and I am using for darkness black and some Persian blue After spreading this color then I use a little bit water and blend this side. It is a white acrylic that I will use in this painting first we make a light outline of this ballad dancer I'm using my SP pencil to make it light after drawing this subject then we will make it dark so first we have to draw outline So after sketching light, then we will make it dark with our HB pencil and we will make this outline visible because it is not seen with a neckties easily. That's why I make it a little bit dark with my HB pencil as you can see now. So watch this video at the end and I hope you will enjoy this video a lot. So after sketching then we will make and paint this subject with crimson blue and corbett blue. I really not want to make this whole painting a fixed color that's why I'm using some mixing with black, corbett blue and persian blue first I make this portion dark then I will use corbett blue for light portion because the straight light coming from here that's why I'm, I will make this portion light and I will use this Persian blue on hands and any other subjects of this painting. I love this way of doing light to dark because it gives a realistic effect on painting. After doing this per part then we will make this hand with Persian blue. If any mistake you have done then you can use your white acrylic color to remove remove 
this color and make this portion light. I will use white acrylic color and show you after trying this portion. Similarly, we fill this Persian blue on this leg. You can use a little bit water to spread this portion, but I am use simply wash my brush and use colors. Now I have already used white uh, watercolor and uh, corbett blue and mix it then I will use in this painting here and now I use a little bit water and I spread this color I'm using a little bit Persian blue and mixing with corbett blue and I will make this portion a little bit dark to make it a realistic effect I'm not using some more different color but this is generally made by blue color Persian blue corbett blue and a little bit black white acrylic colors I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you really want more videos like this then please comment us below about your views about this video and please don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and family because it is so important if you enjoy this video a lot then please share them and if you are new in this youtube channel then please subscribe and support us to achieve our goal of 10,000 subscribers in this month. And please comment your views about this video and if you want more videos like this then please you can comment like and share this video so please do it now first we make a little bit point of this straight light and after then we use the dark tone and make it dark I'm using here my tree number brush for making this straight light I mix watercolor Persian blue and a little bit black I hope this step by step tutorial helping you to understand this subject of drawing step by step. Then we will also draw this straight light similarly that we have already done. Then we use a little bit acrylic paint and we will paint this straight light I really want to make this straight light 3d that's why I'm putting here a little bit white and also here So now I will show you how to erase the incorrect portion if you have already done. I am using a white acrylic for remove the incorrect portion that you have already seen in this video. Here I use to remove this portion. It mix with color and make it light. That's why 
It is also used for erasing the mistake in what a girl. It is acrylic color that I have already used in this street light. You can use acrylic or fabric that you have. So we can use any color acrylic or fabric in this street light. I am giving a white touch on this street light first. Please comment your views about this video and tell us your views that what you are like most in this video and share this video with your friends and family because it is so important for our videos. After spreading and doing this straight light, then we will use white acrylic color for sky and stars. So I am using here a little bit white acrylic for making this painting 3D. So as you can see now, I am using white acrylic color, I have already mixed it and bit with my pencil and spray it on this paper. So now it's ready. I hope you guys enjoyed this video a lot then please don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and family, comment your views about this video, tell us about this video, comment below now. And if you are new in this YouTube channel then please get subscribed now and I will see you on next Tuesday. Thanks for watching.